Welcome to my kitchen. Today I will be making split pea soup. I have a ham bone from a ham that I made yesterday and I just put it in a pan and covered it with water. I'm going to add two bay leaves and I'm going to bring this up to a boil and then I am going to let it simmer for an hour to two hours. Okay, so our ham has been boiling for a little over two hours. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna strain this. I have a bowl with a colander in it and I'm just going to strain it and get the bone out. Okay, so I have my liquid that my ham was boiling in and my ham. I'm gonna set those aside. And in the pan that I was using to boil, I'm going to put one chopped onion. And stir that around. And I'm gonna let the onions cook for a minute or two. And then I have one carrot that I've diced and one stalk of celery. I'm going to add that. Stir that in. And then I'm going to add one pound of green split peas. And get that mixed all in there. And then I'm going to add my liquid. And give that a stir. And then I'm going to add about a teaspoon of thyme. and about a teaspoon of black pepper. And put my bay leaves back in. And I'm going to bring this back up to a boil. And then I'm going to let this simmer for about another hour until my peas start to soften. Okay, so it's been about an hour and I picked all the meat that was on the ham bone and I'm just, I got about a cup of meat. So I'm just going to add that now. And I'm gonna cover this again and let it simmer for about another half an hour it's just starting to thicken, so I'm just going to give it a little bit more time. I'll be back and show you what it looks like. Okay, it's been another half an hour and our soup has thickened up and is ready to serve. This is a great way to use that ham bone and it smells amazing. Just remember to take out your bay leaves that you put in there so nobody eats them. I hope you give this a try. 
Thanks so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. That would help me out a great deal. And I will see you on the next one.